guys, it's about to be midnight. I'm so nervous to see how many smiles I got. It'll be a lot. You're the happiest person I know. I hope so. Oh, wait, it's happening right now. I have a thousand. What about you? One. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's okay. I just won't smile. Are you sure? I've never seen you sad. Hey, Bailey. Hey, guys. Um, whoa, what is wrong with you? Oh, oh that sucks. I have 4,000. Wait, does that mean you can't smile, like, at all? No, only the one time. Ew, we can't hang out with you. Come on, guys, let's go. Uh, I'm sorry, I have to follow them. Don't listen to them. They're assholes. It's not your fault. They were my only friends. I'll be your only friend instead, then. Also, I might have a way of helping you out. Why you gotta be so mean? You need to stay away from my boyfriend. He's coming over and I know that you like him. Maybe we got lost in translation? Don't pretend like you don't know. I saw you flirting with him. It must be exhausting always rooting for the anti-hero. Oh, hey Bailey, uh, I like your outfit today. Lately I've been dressing for revenge. I'm glad you're in a good mood. That made my day a little bit better. Everything will be all right if you keep me next to you. Wait, really? Uh, that's really sweet of you. You belong with me. To be honest, I'm in love with you, not your sister. I used her to get here. Boys only want love if it's torture. I knew it. I knew you were trying to steal my boyfriend this whole time. There's nothing I do better than revenge. How could you do this to me? You're my sister. Don't blame me. Love made me crazy. There is something seriously wrong with you, and you were done. It's me. Hi, I'm the problem. It's me. I was wondering if you guys have Christmas specials. No, we do not have any Christmas specials. Sorry. Wait, are you that guy from yesterday? I'm super late. I have to go. Goodbye. I hate people around the holidays. <laughs> Me too. Dude, there's another gift for you, but you're going to need two hands for this. A guitar? Holy shit. I need to find out who's been giving me these, and I know that guy has something to do with it. He left. What are you going to do? Chase him down? That's a good idea. Sir, wait. Uh, yes? Who are you, and why have you been giving me presents? It's not me, but I do know someone who can help you. Take this number and call them. Why would I call this random phone number? Where did he go? I have nothing else to do. Hello? Hello? Who, who is this? Uh, do you like any car insurance? Salespeople again? Bye. No, wait. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Uh, uh, nothing. You are a terrible liar. You know you can't go outside until you turn 21. But why? I'm 18. Isn't that close enough? No, you're not going outside. I need to know what's out there. I'm going to work. Don't try anything while I'm gone. Okay, see you later. Why is there nothing good on Netflix right now? Who's there? That's definitely not my mom. Bailey, honey, listen to me. There's somebody inside the house. I saw it on the cameras. You have to leave now. But I can't go outside. It's just this one time. The police are on the way to save you right now. What do you mean they'll save me? Okay, this is it. I'm going out the window. Wow. <coughs> Ooh. Hey, you can't touch anything. Why not? You can only touch three things today. I don't understand what the big deal is. You have to save them in case of an emergency, okay? I'm sure it'll be fine. You can only touch your own body or things you're already wearing. I know. Everyone take out your textbooks and open to page three. I can't. You can't touch anything again today, Bailey? Just how it is, I'm sorry. You can follow along with what we're doing on the board. Hey, do you think you could hand me a pencil by any chance? No, uh, I'm sorry. Why not? I can see that you can touch three things. Just use one of them. No, I'm sorry. Just ask someone else. I want you to do it. Hey, what are you doing? Let go of me. Look, it's not that hard. Bitch, did you just slap me? Yes. You're going to regret doing that. Reason? Reason of what? Sorry, I forgot to tell you. You have to pick the reason you die. I don't want to choose the reason that I die. You have to. We all do. Well, it's definitely not going to be by drowning. I'm going to pick the most painless one that I can. Good luck. I don't think any of the options are good. Murder? Oh my god, that's way worse. No. 
Can this give me an option that doesn't suck brutally? <laughs> Bailey! Oh, sis, what's wrong? I didn't pick a reason in time and it picked one for me. What? It picked one for you? Apparently you only get three choices. I didn't know that. I'm so scared to ever get into a car again. I'm so sorry. Be careful with your choices, okay? I will. Please just give me something painless. Your total's 20 even. Babe, I'm so sorry. I don't think I have enough. Hey, it's okay. I got it. Sorry if I embarrassed you back there. No, you're fine. I understand you're going through a tough time with your job. Tomorrow when the amount in my bank account appears, it might come as a bit of a shock to you. Listen, I don't care how low that number is. I'm gonna love you just the same. Poor thing, it's time to see how little he has. What? My boyfriend is a billionaire? No, there has to be some sort of mistake. I, uh, take it you saw my account? Yeah, and you've got a lot to explain. Whose Ferrari is in our driveway? That's mine. Well, actually, it's going to be yours now. What? No, I am still mad at you. Come with me and I'll explain everything. There was a good reason for me lying. Oh yeah? Was there a good reason for you having me buy your meals for the past year? Heck, I even paid your rent one time. I know, I know. And I'll be paying you back for all of it. Why didn't you just tell me? Because every girl I've ever dated has used me for my money. I was tired of dating gold diggers, and I wanted to find a girl who liked me for me. I promise, I will make it all up to you, and I'm going to start by showing you where I really live. Whoa, now hold up. You have a Chick-fil-A in your kitchen? Yep, and there's a McDonald's upstairs. <laughs> Babe, who are you, Richie Rich? Excuse me for just a moment. This is crazy. One of my stocks just went up. A lot. Yeah, actually, I can see that. Why don't you look happy? I'm worried about your safety. You can't tell anyone that you're dating a billionaire. Why can't people know I'm dating a billionaire? Because I'm now one of the youngest billionaires alive. And is that a bad thing? I know a lot of people that would die to get their hands on my money. And you think they'll come after me? I know they will. Promise me you won't tell anyone about my money. Okay, I promise, but you do owe me quite a bit of cash, so what do you say you take me on a little shopping spree? Well, I can't be seen buying you a bunch of stuff, but I can give you this. Babe, this is like 10k. You didn't owe me this much. I know. Consider it a thank you for being so kind to me. I want you to spoil yourself. Oh, hey, Lizzie. Where's your boyfriend? He's at his house. Why? Oh, nothing. I just think it's kind of sad how he never buys you anything. I mean, look at all the stuff you had to buy yourself. It must be hard to date someone poor. Actually, he's not poor. He's one of the richest people alive. What? <gasps> did you enjoy your shopping spree? Uh, yeah, sure did. Good. I also bought you this necklace. Babe, it's beautiful. Thank you. Delivery for Elizabeth? Yes, how much do I owe you? Oh, it's not you who's gonna owe me money. It's your boyfriend. Lizzie, it's 1 a.m. Why are you up? This isn't Lizzie, but if you want to see her again, you're gonna do exactly as I said. You want me to wire you one billion dollars? Yeah, do it now or she's gone. No, I'll send it. It's done. Now let me speak to her. Okay, talk. Liam, I'm so sorry. This is all my fault. I accidentally told someone that you were... It's okay. I planned for this. Remember that necklace I gave you? Yeah. It's a tracker, babe. No! Please, freeze! Thank you, Liam. I'm glad you were able to get your money back. I don't care about the money. I'm just happy you're okay. Come on, please give me blue. Mom will disown me if I get red. Pink? What the hell is pink? Why are you wearing that shirt? Oh, because that's the color I was assigned. You need to go take it off right now. What? Why? You cannot be walking around wearing pink. Go put on blue instead. Okay, geez. Is this better? Yeah, nobody will be able to tell now. Okay, good. Oh, Bailey, you got blue too? Um, yeah, I did. Why did you say it like that? You seem nervous. Like what? I'm not nervous. I heard that Martha got the color purple. Like what? <laughs> Purple? That's crazy. What does that mean? I don't know, but they said they're gonna kill anyone with a different color. They're gonna what? Um, yeah, you didn't know that? Are you okay? 
No, I'm fine. I just hope that nobody got pink. That's the worst color of all. What did you say? If we don't leave now, he's gonna come out to kill you. Okay, let's go. Shouldn't we like call the police on him though? No, that's what I did and in the future they never got him. I'm gonna save you from all of this. I'll be right back. How are you gonna save me? I'm gonna kill him so that you can have a normal life. What? Isn't that a bad idea? Of course not. It'll be fine. Okay, I did it. It's done. That was so fast. I have to go back to the future now. Bye. You're just gonna leave? I'm gonna get in trouble if I don't get home right now. She just killed someone and wants me to go get a Red Bull? Fine, whatever. There she is. Excuse me. Is your name Bailey? Yes. You're under arrest for the murder of your recent boyfriend. Whoa, whoa. I didn't do that. This videotape is showing you committing the crime. That's not me. The, uh, you have the right to remain silent. You'll be coming to the station with us. Today I'm going to be picking out my outfit with a blindfold on. We have moved to the inside of my closet and I'm just going to blindfold myself. I don't even know where I'm going. We're just going to reach this one. I feel like I should look. <laughs> okay, we might as well pick out a coat too. What's this? Oh, I actually really like this jacket. Now on the floor, and whatever the first shoes I touch are, I'm gonna wear them. Okay. Ah! This is my skirt drawer, honestly. I, oh, I'm just gonna dig through here. I'm gonna go for the bottom ones because I don't even know what's down there. What am I holding up to? Okay, hello? Let's just try on the full fit and see what it looks like. Are we ready for the final fit? Because I don't know if you can handle all this. Upon putting this top on, I realized that it's actually broken. <laughs> this is kind of a moment. And then we just lift the light and mm, put it back down, put it back down. Rate my outfit one to 10 in the comments. <laughs> oh, there you are. Good morning, dork. I am not a dork. Whatever you say. Hey, do you think my new haircut looks dumb? I don't like it. I think it looks really good. Right, you have to say that because you're my best friend. That's not true, you look great. Did you hear that we're getting a new student too? Yeah, we haven't had a new student in so long. <laughs> I know, I wonder who it's gonna be. Class, everyone meet Macy. Whoa, she's so pretty. Yeah, I, I guess so. Hey Macy, you should come over here. Take a seat next to us. Hi guys. Oh, my name's Jason and this is Bailey. Nice to meet you. You should come sit with us at lunch. Would that be okay? Yeah, for sure. Good morning. Uh, you didn't leave a seat open for me. Oh, my bad. I kind of forgot. I'll see you at lunch then. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Macy, what were you saying? Girl, you better tell him that you love him. I don't love him. Are you sure about that? Drop this. Oh, thank you. I don't even own a TV. Whatever, I guess I'll just throw this away. What is this? I guess the only way to find out is to push one. Now I just have to figure out what that exactly paused. Why did all those people freeze at the exact same time? Does this pause time? Oh, I'm gonna get some good use out of this. Everyone, please put your phones away for the test. I forgot to the test. I know what to do. Just gonna steal the answer key real quick. Don't mind me, sorry. Play. You may now begin, you have one hour. Hey, uh, can I talk to you? What's up, babe? Yeah, so I'm sorry, but I have to break up with you. What? Mm, just one second. Hey, babe. Oh, uh, hey, what's up? I'm breaking up with you. What? Are you serious? Yeah, bye. Oh, wow. Mm. Are you trying something new with your hair? No, what do you mean? Look at yourself. <gasps> what happened to my hair? Honestly, I think it's kind of cool. It looks like a bird's nest. Looks like you have some pink strands of hair now, too. Apparently. I guess it could have been worse. It could have been country. I fell in love with an emo girl. All I want is... Very funny. You know, you kind of look like Machine Gun Kelly, too. Thanks. Why do you look like Hot Topic threw up on you? Guys, okay, it wasn't me. It was my soulmate. I don't want to dress like this. You know, maybe you should. It kind of suits you. Maybe your soulmate just has a crush on Avril Lavigne. That's fair, me too. Or they might be like a super famous rock star. I really doubt that, but it would be super cool. Guys, is that who I think it is? Looks like your rock star isn't that far away after all. 